going on y'all try to do another set of legs here for another table I'm trying to get everything i got a little little uh gig at the harley davidson shop they let me hang out around there um this is another one man that's gonna just kind of make people's freaking heads explode there's so much bs that's being told around that Nobody really knows what's going on. The numbers being fluctuated. There's things, you know, people being lied to and us being told a certain thing about all the the things coming, you know, stuff coming across the border. And there are a lot of fluctuations on the numbers. So they've been only talking about a couple of million. Well, more people that have been down around the border are saying it's more like 20 plus million, maybe closer to 30 by now. Literally. So, along with the other one, you know, if they don't hit us with nukes, thank God, but there's enough people here in this country that can cause a lot of problems. A lot of problems. Now, this is just some other things that I've heard that, oh man, uh, the left is even thinking about trying to, uh, wow. When the election goes down and it doesn't come out the way that they want it to do, to happen, they are going to use like tactics like the, what the Somalis did in Black Hawk Down, piling the streets up with furniture and burning tires and shutting down the whole intersection. And you know, there's already people standing out in the inter intersection and all. Well, think of you getting up, and I mean, all these intersections have burning tires in them. You can't get through them. You can't go nowhere. Burning, everything burning, you know, just right there in the intersection. All they got to do is shut the traffic down. People can't get to work and nothing like that. And if it happens all over, you've seen Antifa, how they can send out a deal. Oh, yeah, and that's something else. The deals about the, uh, the phones that everybody that's coming across that they're getting all government stuff and they can send all of them a message at the same time y'all telling them to do something just like what Antifa used Twitter and Snapchat and all these other little apps and where you at and all that other kind of stuff from what I heard yeah because they can they can have a freaking you know they got a bunch of them. They're a bunch of low-life losers. They ain't got no job. They got nothing to do. But they got time to go out and cause all this mayhem and anarchy, you know, blah, blah, blah. But for the ones that want to let things, let people live their lives and let people be prosperitable in their lives and all what they need to do, with, they ain't going to want that until it starts affecting their mommies Ooh, and their daddies. Then they'll care because their allowance will get shut off. Mom and daddy, may I have some wool? <laughs> you know? But yeah, that's what I'm hearing. It's not two million. It's more in the numbers of 20 plus million. Maybe close to 30. But you think about it, they've all got the phones from the same place. George Soros has been buying up Mexican speaking radio stations here in the U.S. What do you think he's telling them? If you have anybody that does speak Spanish, well then you need to start listening up on some of the radio stations and things like that to see what they're saying. Everybody needs to brush up. We're going to need each other before all this is over with. 
I've been saying for quite some time, you want to really hurt us, hit our power grid. You hit our power grid, that's going to set up so much confusion. The stores, refrigeration, gas, no money, you know, no lights, red, red, green lights working and all that. I'm, are you serious? The way these morons are driving down the road, staring at their phone, you know. Yeah. Those idiots. But that's what I'm thinking and what I'm hearing. There's a lot of people that know a lot more than me. Like I say, Monkey Works on YouTube. He is a plethora of information. It's a lot of information, but if you slow down and just watch it and pay attention, he, he explains it very, very good. I just want everybody to be safe and know what's going on. The Doomsday Preppers, that's a real good thing. Like I said, that's good knowledge. Think about what you're going to need. And if you're into camping or you know somebody's into camping or whatever, get some information from them. Because they know all kinds of stuff about how to take water, filtration. You can still use plant life and all the ground and grass and all to purify water. Yes, takes time. You know how to run a steel. You can do that too. You know, you take dirty water and turn it into pretty good water. Yeah. Salt water, seawater. Yeah, if you know how to do it. But uh, check your Army Navy stores. Like I say, those guys, they are very informative. Know a lot of stuff about what's in their store. They have MREs and other kinds of stuff, just like the single ones, like the military guys eat. So they're packed with protein and all. You know, I don't know about the GMO, but you can get the older ones, make sure that they don't have any GMO. The older ones, I don't, I know they didn't, but uh, yeah, these new ones, you got to be careful. So, the people that are coming here are not going to be friendly. A lot of people talk about the Purge movie and all. Okay. There are more good Americans in this country that have more ammo and we have more guns than any standing army on the face of the planet, y'all. But calm, cool, and collected wins the day. Don't be scared. Be prepared. So... Check out some other stuff. I've got some other videos and all. And I'm coming up with some more information every day. I'm trying to put out as much as I can. Because I think the Sons of Guns are about to make us go black. Yeah. Even maybe for a little bit. Kind of like what the test run, you know. Even though it was cold here in Texas. I had a friend of mine that his mom passed away because of that BS. So, yeah. They're talking about the power grid being you know able to take a hit because of the heat here in texas and everybody running their air conditioning so a lot of things happening y'all think about what you need for you and your family it'll be all right i got more y'all take care god bless you god bless the usa and screw you commies y'all have a good day Bye.